Thought I'd sit down and make a short little video thanking you guys all so much for the support you've shown me, you've shown my teammates, and you've shown the University of Akron cross country team in this hard time. The only thing we can really do right now is bring light to the situation and that is what I continue to do. Um, I want to get this out there. I want people talking about it. Um, I've posted a short little thing on Twitter yesterday that got a ton of publicity. A lot of people talking about it, a lot of people liking it. Um, I received hundreds of DMs. I received a ton of Strava comments. I received a ton of Instagram love um, just saying like you guys telling me that you're with me in this time and that truly means the world to me. I, I can't thank you guys enough for the support everyone has shown me. Um, I think the Akron alum, the cross country alum, people like JT Olson that are leading this fight to get cross country back at the University of Akron, I pray that this decision is reversed and I can continue to run at the University of Akron. Uh, me and my teammates are going to continue to fight this decision and see what we can do. The budget isn't set in stone until like four to six weeks from now, so technically we have four to six weeks, I believe, to fight this decision and see if we can get this reversed. But uh, yeah, let's just uh, let's just take it day by day, see how it goes. But I really wanted to make this short video. Thank you, you guys, so much for the support. Seriously, it means the world to me that people I don't even know are reaching out, you know, saying that they're with me in this time, and it's crazy that you know, running as a community came together and supported me and my teammates through this. And uh, like I said, going to continue to fight. That's what we do. Uh, going to keep you guys updated. Going to keep making videos for you guys. And we'll see where this goes. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.